Okay. Hmm. So, I wanted to talk about something that kind of had me fucked up yesterday and made me feel some type of way because this was fucked up and I've never seen anything like it before in my 18 years of living. So, this had me fucked up. So, yesterday I was going to hang out with some friends, and I had to get on the bus. So, I was walking to the bus, I had to take two buses, I already had taken one bus, and I had to get on another bus. So, I was walking to take the bus, and I knew the bus was going to be late, or I knew I'd catch the bus faster. If I walked to um, a closer stop, I guess, rather than staying where I usually would have stayed. And I probably wouldn't have seen this if I would have stayed, which is what I'm saying. So, I'm walking, and I see this girl, and she's walking on the opposite side of the street from me. I'm on one side, she's on the other. And... I hear someone yelling, and I'm like, must be some crazy guy, like, I mean, I live in an area, well, I don't live in an area, I was in an area where crazy people can be crazy people, and that's fine, so, I hear this guy, and he's yelling, and I'm like, Okay, cool story. And I see the girl who was on the opposite side of the street from me walking to my side of the street. And I'm like, okay. Okay, fine. And then I see the guy who was yelling. And he was walking up the street on the side where the girl was and he was yelling and I noticed he had something in his hand and I'm looking and it was a belt and so it took me a minute I'm I'm pretty sure you guys can already tell what this was but I'm looking, like, it took me a minute, I'm like, I'm like, guy, plus yelling, plus belt, equals possibly upset parent, and I'm like, okay, before I was able to really think about what this was, He kind of started hitting her, the girl, who was not even on my side of the sidewalk yet. Not even on my side of the street. She was in the middle of the street, kind of, like, getting, like, hit in the leg with a belt. And I was walking past them, like, like, I, oh, I was walking, like, down the street past them like they weren't on the sidewalk so I didn't have to like "Mm, excuse me no I was walking and I walked past them and in my head before I actually passed them I was like what should I do should I stop and say something Or should I just keep going? And reluctantly, I just kept going. Now, I've been thinking about this ever since it happened. And even while it was happening, I was like, I understand disciplining your kid. 
is or disciplining somebody. I mean, because I'm 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 pretty sure he wasn't a crazy guy who was just caring about beating girls, but I knew he was a parent or the I don't even want to say a friend of a parent because that's fucked up, but. I understand disciplining your kid. Um, I understand that. I mean, I don't know what the situation was. So that's another reason why I didn't stop because I didn't know what the situation was. Um, Regardless, I will say you don't beat your kids in the street, like in the street. Like, literally, like, you don't beat your kids in the street. That That's that's no good. If you had a problem, then, yes. I mean, disciplining your kid however you want, I feel, is fine. Ugh. Hmm. But in the street, that was no good. But I'm like, I don't know what the situation is. He was telling her to go back home. So I'm guessing that she was either going somewhere she wasn't supposed to be going or she snuck out. But that's none of my business. It just, I felt bad about just walking away because 